All right, cyberspace, garbage pill junkies, what's going on, prospectors? I got me a tin. We're looking for. You know what we're looking for. Plate, sketch, auto, plate, sketch, auto, plate, sketch, auto, plate, sketch, auto. What's in there? So, I opened up the uh, 35th anniversary. I never got that never got any of the cards got the can tried it out i love the cards i like how they do the past present and the future versions of the cards i thought they were awesome artwork i didn't really get a big big hit i got dead ted's grave dirt which was pretty cool to me it's better than like the mermaid sand or anything else i saw i would have loved the sketch i would have loved an auto but uh that didn't pan out, okay? Yes. Sweet. Snatched up a case of the vinyl figures. I had some from back in the day. I had the Boney Tony, and I had the um, Ashley. And I also have um, Nasty Nick, but he's upstairs wearing like a Patriots toque, uh, like a little, little tiny one. So he's upstairs, but... Um, I opened them. I got three doubles. Um, I got another Nasty. I got another Ashley. And I got another Boney Tony. And besides that, I completed my whole set. So I have them all now, which is pretty damn cool. So anyway. Oh, what do we have in here? This is all I want to see. You, you see, the other thing was with breaking the 35th anniversary, I was more intrigued to see... Um, what was there because I had never I never messed with them I never opened one I don't know I had never messed with them so I didn't know any of the cards I didn't know what's a good hit what's a bad hit and, well I ended up getting three reds and I got the, the dirt which was cool oh I can't wait to see what we get in here I just want I got a lot of autos right now and I'm trying to Let's go. Plate auto sketch. Let's go. Alright, so yeah, I had to take a little time off. I ended up getting some more supply and I have a lot of product to now to break, which I love breaking. I love opening stuff. I want to try to find like the coolest hits. Which is why I love doing it. I'm like, it's way safer than any kind of drugs, right? I mean, I'm not hurting nobody. <laughs> but I do. I love the hits, you know? It's very addicting. You get, like, one of those one-of-a-kinds, and you're like, ooh, ooh. Especially, like, I got some nice ones. Um, and they just, they, they feel good when you hit them. And you can't believe that you bought, like, a pack, and they were inside a pack. Like, this amazing artwork was inside a pack, you know? Even the back, the puzzles on the back are amazing, you know? So, it's cool to collect them. I like them. I really do like this series. So, um, we're going to open this one up and see what we got. See if we get anything good. Good, good, good. We do not want it. I don't want to jinx us, but you know what? I don't think it's going to happen. We don't want none of the patches. No wacky package. Packages. Patches. No. See that? Three times fast. Wacky package. Patches. Wacky package. Patches. Wacky package. Patches. Woof. That's about as fast as I could say it anyway. All right. be interesting if we get an auto that I'd like. I need yeah, I need some. Let's just say that. Let's just say I'm trying to do the impossible. You know? And you know what they also say? All these odds we will break them, bash them, shatter them. 
I mean, if I've watched videos where people who have never even collected comic book kids are opening up one blaster box and getting a plate, well, then we can defy the odds, too. Let's go. Let's go, prospectors. See, that was what was weird. I was out there prospecting those 35th anniversary cards with with no, um, just no knowledge in the field. I just didn't know much about them. I really like them. I got to look over them again. I opened them and and then ended because, uh, man, I when I opened them, it was in the middle of the, mm, it wasn't the middle of the morning, but the sun was just coming up. Then all of a sudden, pitter-patter a little feet. And I had to stop. I had to stop breaking. I was going to break. This is what's going to be interesting, too. I know what I got out of that bin, right? Out of that hobby tin for the 35th anniversary. Let's see if this this tin's better. This is a food fight tin. And that was a trash can. Honestly, the fridge is cool. I think the trash can's better. You can fit two or three of those little um, vinyl guys in there. I, like the, I think the trash can's cool. Maybe it's cool if I only have one. <laughs> and I have like 15 of these refrigerators. Come on. Uh-oh. I'll tell you what's crazy. I haven't felt nothing in these packs. I'm looking through. I don't see nothing. I don't feel nothing. I don't even feel it. Adam Appetite. <clears throat> I really did like the 35th anniversary. They had... The different the, the 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 different atom bombs and the different oh I think there's something in this this one this one this this one feels a little solid probably just an atom appetite tell you one thing we didn't get so far is we didn't get one of those stupid patches that we were talking about it's supposed to be a guaranteed hit in all these tins right right what's our hit What's our hit? <clears throat> what are we gonna get? Ooh. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Alright. We got the goods. You ready? Let's see what we got. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Sloppy. Sloppy. Let's do this. I'm being way too sloppy. I want to put my, <clears throat> I want to put my goodies over there, and I want to be able to... Oh, you know what's weird is... <clears throat> The back of my leg was itching right now. And I uh, literally pulled a tick, a wood tick, a dead tick, off the side of my neck. It was crawling. I could feel something crawling on me. It was a tick. That was like, I don't know, half hour ago. So now I'm itching like I got ticks on me. You know that feeling when you had pulled a bug off you or a tick? All right, let's go. Forget the ticks. Uh, let's see what we got. We're just looking for the hits, you know. What do we got? Come on. It's like I'm. It's like I just float through the base because I already know all of it. I'm not looking for any base. I got the base ten times over. <clears throat> take it. We'll take it. It's not what we want. We do not. We do not call those hits. 
was a nice atom bomb. Nice. I got a hundred of those. You want some good stuff. You want the good stuff. Give us the goodies. I need an autograph. Give me an atom bomb autograph in here. How about atom bomb autograph? I'll be souped. But that's not even one that I need. It's just one that I'll accept. <laughs> Please give me something good. The prospect in here. Oh, we got a Goldie. We got a Goldie. We got a Goldie. I don't have this one. Oh, two's my favorite number. Two's my lucky number. We get number two, Soupy. Nice. Very, very nice. Yeah, I had to wait for top holders. It took a minute. I got them. And then, you know what's funny? I talked to my younger brother today, and that's why I was going to ask for some top loaders. And he says, man, I need some top loaders. I said, well, I'm glad I got some. Not that I won't. Let him borrow some, but I'm glad I got him and didn't wait around for him. Because I'd be waiting. Because these things got to get... Look at that. That's nice. Anyway, what I was trying to say is, it's number two of 50. Unbelievable. Number two of 50. Sweet. Mm. Is a gold a hit? Is that a hit, like, better than... No, I don't know. I I would... I mean, I guess it is a hit. I don't know what the ratio is on that, but I wouldn't call it an autograph, and I wouldn't call it a sketch. I like the black peppers. I'm going to be able to, <clears throat> I think, by the time I'm done, uh... <clears throat> Complete a set, a whole, a whole set, A and B. That guy, 76, I need 76. I'll take him too. I'll take 76 autograph, come on. Gotta be something in here. Right? I feel like these tins are uh where you gotta go to get the goodies. This is my second Jasmine. Check it out. I love how she uses the glitter, man. It's crazy. Now that's a hit. That's a hit. Man, that's a hit. That's a hit. It's a beautiful card. So that's Boney Joni, right? With a chicken drum. She's got a leg of chicken. Well, let's not assume it's chicken. It could be turkey. That is pretty tight, huh? Wow. That's a hit. That is a hit. So... You know what? Anytime. Wow, what did what an amazing God. <clears throat> 
I have already gotten a sketch. Uh, the other sketch that I got. I don't know if anybody's seen it. I have. I run like two pages. So I got. <clears throat> I got Blunt Factory. And I got Bluntimus Prime. I'm only going to be doing drops on the Bluntimus Prime. I got more subs. On this page. And people can see. Everything that I do. with Whether we're on stage doing music. Or whether we're. Whatever we're doing, whether I'm at a concert or on stage doing a concert or if we're uh, just fishing or having a fire or doing anything. I just have more people on this, more more people will see it, more traffic. But this is the second one I got. I think the first one I pulled is on my other page. But I pull an autograph and a sketch in the same tin. I'm going to say, tell you something crazy, okay? If we pull this, the Goldie, this, and an auto, woo I'm, I don't know. I can't even say that this, actually, I think this would beat my other 10. It would because of the gold. But I'll still take an auto. Can we get one? That would be unbelievable. That would be unbelievable. I'm not going to be greedy. I'm not going to be greedy. That's a beautiful bony Joni eating a turkey limb. It's a great, great sketch card. Yeah, it's crazy. Um, I got a bunch of tins and my homie wanted one. And uh, I sold to him for what I got it for. No big deal. And he took it. And he, I think when he got home, he didn't get much. I don't think he got much. I know he didn't get a sketch. I know he didn't get... Oh, no, he got an autograph. I'm sorry. He got an auto. Is what he got. But he's dying for a sketch. He wants a sketch. I understand. I'm spoiled, though. My first sketch was not on video, so nobody has seen it. It's uh, an amazing card. Very amazing. Um, but I'll put a thing out one day. I'll show everybody all my hits. But I hit that one, and then, then I hit a try, a try fold. Then I hit that last one with the glitter. Now I got this one. That's my fourth sketch. It's sweet. I like the sketches. The sketches, I think, I think that makes the collecting the cards cool because it's. Oh, look at that. I like that when when you get them back to back like that. You know what I mean? That's the thing that was crazy in the tin can. I had so many A and B, A and B, A and B of characters. Uh, I am. Um, I'm ready to open some hobby boxes of uh, 35th anniversary. See what we get. We'll do it today, but I do plan on. It. Oh, number eight B. I need this one. Anybody got that one autograph? Let me know. Let's trade. Let's bada. Love it. I love it. So disgusting. Disgusting. Come on, prospectors. We're down to the last couple couple swings here. We get an autograph in here. I have got so many base cards. It's insanity. All right, ready? Mm -hmm. 
I don't see it happening today. That's all right. It was still good with that big hit. Oof. Oh, my goodness. I got a blood red coming. That's cool. That's real cool. Wasn't expecting that. I'll take it. Jar Chuck. Wow. 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 This is crazy. I'm going to say this is a big hit. I've never even got something like this. It is A. You see that? Oh, my goodness. That's a one of 75. I got a number one card. A number one. <clears throat> Excuse me, folks. A number one. Wow. A Goldie, a number one, and a sketch. I got a hobby box. Should I break it? I haven't got anything out of the hobby boxes, though. They just make me so angry. You know what I mean? Let's just try. I bought them the break. That's what I bought them for. Ah, uh, so, um, honestly, I gotta say the, uh, food fight tin was more powerful than the, uh, it was more powerful than the, uh, the trash can. The trash can, I just got the, the dead. Nah. I mean, it says sketch card. Look for sketch cards, autos, printing plates, and more. Look for exclusives. You are what you eat and blue sticker cards. So... The only thing that I've ever get out of these are blue sticker cards, which they're the spit cards, right? One of them blue sticker cards. Okay, so that's cool. I get them, I got them. They're numbered. Those are numbered. But I think those, honestly, those, they don't do nothing for me, man. They don't do nothing for me, man. They're like that public enemy song, you know? It don't do nothing for me. I'm all set. Let's rip these. I'm just feeling like let's do it. You know why? Because if I'm going to do the base and I have to put the base away, I might as well put a bunch of base away. It just makes it pointless. I'll put them in tins. I just... Doubt anything's gonna be in. I'm, I'm just make me a believer, Hobby Box. Make me a believer. You see what we're doing? We're prospecting. This is how we, we sometimes we gotta prospect. Sometimes you just gotta prospect, you know. I'm making a mess again. I gotta put these the other way. I gotta throw these this way so you don't have to deal with them and I don't have to deal with them. Mm. 
There's my dog again. It's like, you know what? Don't come here. Listen. To watch Garbage Pail Kids and hear, ha- ha- like, anything cool. Because I'm going to just be rambling. And my dog's going to be snoring. So, if you're here just to check out what cards I get, then you're at the right spot. If you're here to hear a crazy man ramble and a dog snore, I guess you're in the right spot. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, so, I got these cards. I like them. I got a couple more. I ended up <clears throat> scoring a case of tins. So I got a case of tins. It's a 40, <clears throat> 40 tins in a case. Mini fridges, blasters, whatever you want to call them. I could bang some of them out, but I'll wait. It would be interesting to see what's in there. <clears throat> I got a four-piece sketch out of a blaster tin, man. I'm telling you, that was that was my first sketch ever, and uh, I ended up buying the um thirty-year this documentary story of um. Garbage Peel, and it's amazing. I, I didn't even get to finish it. I watched a little bit of it. I love it. But, um... That John Brown, man, he's amazing. I love this little guy. Right? He made this guy. And the Dead Dead. And the Atom Bomb. He made all these cool, iconic characters. It's just insane. I gotta finish it. It's um something I'll probably try doing later. When I get done this, pull all those damn ticks off me. <laughs> Put the flick in and Alright, so I'm not trying to throw any curveballs at you, but I already saw the blue spit. That was a long time ago. It was like one of the first packs when I was putting it in. Besides that, I haven't seen anything. <clears throat> I haven't felt anything. I'll tell you though, that last, that thing snuck in, right? These things, you know what? I'm not gonna lie. I got three more. What do I got, three? Or two more of these things. You gotta make me a believer here with these, with these, uh, you know. Cause I swear every time I read it, oh, look for sketch, auto print, sketch, auto print, sketch, auto print, sketch, auto print, and more, and more. Okay, well, can I get any of those in these? Cause I don't get anything. Uh, I think the most I've got was three. Adam Appetites, three digital codes. And got the Dead Ted Sand. That was the graveyard dirt. That was cool yesterday out of the can. But there was nothing special. I would have loved to get a sketch instead. That sketch I just got is so cool. It makes it makes my prospecting unbelievable. It makes Prospecting so good it makes it feel great, you know. Will it make this crappy hobby box good? No, but it'll help. It'll it'll take the horrible feeling and make it bearable. So let's get something hobby box. Do something for us. I have opened six. This is now my seventh hobby box. What are you doing? I'm going to have to give up on you, hobby box. I don't want to. I got a good relationship with you, GPK. You know, food fight. You've been good to me. Except 
hobby boxes. Right? Hobby boxes just aren't doing anything nice. All right, so you've seen a whole box. That's 24 packs, okay? Open. What are we going to get? Let's see. The Bob Burger, okay. Green Parallel. Boogers. Booger. Booger, booger, booger. Booger Green. I should... I haven't really even looked, but I should... Um, have enough to do a full set, 1 through 100, A and B, with the booger. I love these cards. Um, that was the thing I liked about the 35th anniversary, though, too, was the, like, they had one that looked like pumpkin head. They had one that, they had cool ones. They had the Frog Brothers <laughs> from the Lost Boys. They had a bunch of cool ones. This is taking it overboard, though. You know, you buy, you buy, you get the cards, you open them, you get nothing. And that's when you're like, that's when you really feel like a junkie. You're like, man, I'm hit, looking for hits. I'm missing. Where's the hits? You're trying. It's a gamble. How can you win if you don't play, right? You gotta get out there and play the game if you want to win. All right, prospectors, what's going on? We got to find something here. We got to get something good. I need this one. I need that one. I do. These hobby boxes are just they're just so disappointing to me. They really are. I, I just I feel like a um, a victim of abuse 